Now, NMN is becoming so popular that it is everywhere you look from social media channels like TikTok and Instagram to word of mouth. So NMN stands for nicotinamide mononucleotide, which is a molecule derived from vitamin B3 found naturally in your body. And it is said to be a precursor as it is found to be converted into another molecule called NAD, which stands for nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide. So while NMN is what's been advertised, NAD is actually the active molecule that your body needs for metabolism and basic function of your cells. So basically, if you take an NMN supplement, your body actually converts it to NAD, but for the purposes of this video, let's just stick to NMN as that's what's being marketed. So what does NMN actually do? As you get older, the levels of NMN in your body declines. So your DNA can get damaged as you get older. And as the levels of NAD in your body reduces and your cells do not divide and multiply as well as they used to. So you need NMN for DNA repair. You're also exposed to environmental factors such as heat, radiation, chemicals that can damage DNA. However, the ability of NMN to repair DNA is now being marketed by some companies as being able to live longer by slowing the aging process and possibly protecting against cancer due to its antioxidant properties. NMN can increase the sensitivity of the body's cells to insulin, as it has shown that people who develop type 2 diabetes as they get older have lower levels of NMN and NAD. NMN has also been shown in animal studies to improve heart and brain function, so people report better cardiovascular output with increased physical activity, as well as enhanced cognitive function with feeling sharper, more alert and improved concentration levels, and even improved eyesight where people report to no longer needing to wear glasses. People who have taken NMN supplements have reported feeling more energetic, sleeping better, and it is thought that NMN helps with jet lag, as well as regulating your body's sleep-wake cycle, known as your natural circadian rhythm. Interestingly, people have reported that NMN has helped reverse their grey hairs to become darker, though I must stress that there is no scientific basis for this yet. But it could be that it is the antioxidative properties of NMN that helps to reduce the oxidative stress that turn hairs grey, which happens by reducing melanin production. And could NMN also cause hair growth? Hmm. So NMN is available as supplements and you can buy them online in powder or capsule form and it comes in different doses from 250 mg per day to as high as 1.2 grams per day. NMN is best taken first thing in the morning or on an empty stomach 30 minutes before food. But does NMN have any side effects? Now side effects are going to be based on what people report. So people have reported skin reactions like rash, feeling itchy, digestive problems like bloating, nausea, loose bowels, and they are most commonly reported with high doses of 1.2 grams a day. Other side effects include headache, dizziness, and sleep disturbances, as NMN does make you alert. So you might want to take it early in the morning, but no serious side effects have been reported as such, whether it's the 250 milligram or the 1.2 gram dose per day. It is also said that these side effects do tend to improve as your body adjusts to the supplement. The question with side effects is that is it the NMN itself or the ingredients used alongside the NMN? As it's always difficult to tell, especially when these supplements are not regulated in the same manner as your prescription drugs. Also, everyone's biological makeup is different. Give two people the same drug, one would have side effects and the other person would not have any side effects whatsoever. Side effects of NMN are still being investigated and the FDA have banned the sale of NMN in America as a dietary supplement due to potential safety concerns concerning the liver and the stomach while it remains legally available in the UK. Now, one main concern is what is the impact of the long-term use of NMN? For example, could long-term use increase the risk of cancer. The theory here is that the cancer cells could use NAD to enhance their function, so you might want to maybe for now not take them for like two or three years non-stop until there is more data available. The good news is that if you're not keen on NMN supplements, you can actually find them naturally in foods such as raw beef, cabbages, avocados, broccoli, but at a dose of one meal per one gram. So if you compare that to a supplement of a low dose of 250 milligrams, you can see that the levels in food are insufficient. Now let's look at reviews of NMN. I picked on one of the popular brands known as Viva NMN. Viva NMN claims to use the highest pure quality ingredients with 94% customer satisfaction. So I looked at Trustpilot reviews. Right, so one review says this stuff works. As a 54 year old perimenopausal personal trainer, I am skeptical about any product like Viva NMN. 
I've had no side effects, five stars. Okay, good. Another star review, again, five stars. I forgot to click for the free bottles and the free for two offer, but it doesn't really tell me how good the M NMN was. Okay, this is more useful. Another five stars. I've been taking this NMN for three months. Immediately, I was sleeping earlier and deeper and waking up ready to go when usually I'm quite sluggish and struggle to fall asleep. My skin is visibly smoother and my gray hairs are taking a few weeks longer to show, which saves me a lot of money. Okay. Oh, look at this. One star. Disrupted sleep and hideous indigestion. Like others similarly, I have taken this supplement in the morning as directed. I was already taking nutrition gigs, MG glycinate, three in one. Right, so this had sleeping problems. In eight days, my sleep has reduced the worst in the past year of up to four hours last night. Again, five stars, five stars. I mean, you can go on Trustpilot and read the reviews for yourself. Anyway, I'm not endorsing Viva NMN as a particular brand. It was just a brand that I picked because it's the brand that's doing the rounds on social media forums like TikTok. You can do your own research and find out what brand that you would like to take. Overall, there has been good views of you know, NMN. Could it be a placebo effect? Does it actually work? I don't know, but that's something for you to decide for yourself. Disclaimer, I am not saying take NMN and you have better sleep, you have better energy, you have reduced gray hairs. I'm not saying any of that. This is just a review of NMN and just to let you know what it claims to do as well as the side effects. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please feel free to share, like and subscribe.